Hello guys, uh, this is a Mazda, what year is it? It's a uh, 16 Mazda CX-5. Um, been working on this, I've done a camshaft in this. I have it running there, but I am left with one cold. And it is in the start-stop unit. Uh, V13D3. Hatch anti theft system transmitter. I believe that is the battery in the key. Um, weak battery in the key. So I'm going to replace the battery in the key in this Mazda CX-5 to get rid of that code. Um, so just a short video on doing this there and now. So I'll get, the, I'll get the key and we'll do the switch away with the new battery. So hopefully that will be that code then. Okay guys, there's the key. So I'm going to open this up to change the battery inside in it. Just hand this over to Rory. So first of all, it's this little tab there. Pull that. That takes up that. And then this key should split. Pry open. Carefully just go along. And then we're left with as she says the name of the, the number of the battery on it. It's CR2025. Take up that tab. And there is my battery. So I'm gonna swap out that. Okay lads, here's my new battery. Uh, CR2025 and again it's, it's quite simple just slip that in little cover goes on press it down the other half of the key goes together and it should just clippity clickety click and there we go that's the battery in the key of the Mazda CR CX5 changed so yeah, quite simple now. Um, let's stick that in there. Ignition on. Clear codes. Codes cleared. squeeze start the car I will just see how we got that cold cropping up there again I'm waiting for that to load ah look I suppose rather than waiting here, we're not to loading up. We're pretty much done with the video. It's just a quick video just to show the changing the battery and the key of a Mazda. Um, going to be the same with the Mazda 6, same as the Mazda 3, CX-5 I'm on here. Um, and yeah, look, that's it. Right. Just a quick video on changing the battery and the key in the Mazdas. Right, thanks again for watching. Bye. Okay, lads, sorry about that now, but uh, just the scan tool decided to wake up there and went through the whole um, system scan and you can see that one is now showing green, no faults. So our battery in the key did fix that fault. So yeah, that's a wrap, lads. Thanks again.